Go straight to the Mata, then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Open his Sata, then I'm dancing my cha cha. Open his Zaza, and go straight to the Mata, then I'm up in the chopper, hitting the cha cha. Then I'm hitting his Sata. Blessings upon blessings to each and every one of you that came in to listen to my commentary video. Know your thoughts and your opinion and your inputs are truly welcome on the comments down below. Even if you and I have different standpoints of different opinions and thoughts and inputs, it's always going to be respected in my end if it's respectful. So let me get into this commentary. So, CJ came out with another video yesterday stating that he hired a security. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I heard it. He hired a security. And allegedly that security is no other than his baby mama, Nike. As we all know, he hired Nike because, you know, he claims to say that he feel more protected with Nike. He know Nike will have to, you know, put a person in the spot when it comes to him because she allegedly is about that life. So Proceed to say that he has Nike, so when it's time to pick up the kids, if royalty comes out her neck again, that she's there to defend him. And he also paid her 20K. Mm hmm. You heard it. 20K for security, for him to be security. Now I'm like, I, 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 you know how many times y'all I be. <laughs> I can't. I can't with CJ. You know how many times I remind that part and I'm like, are you okay, CJ? Are you running a fever? Do you feel sick, Papa? Are you okay? What's wrong? Because I know if you have people that's helping you with your channel will tell you, don't go put that. It's only going to make matter worse. But then again, I'm starting to think, hmm, clicks, views equal a good revenue for them, money. I said, this is starting to seem like a fucking Twilight Zone. Like, why? Like, why? So, he goes on to say, you know, he's just tired of being ambushed every time he go pick up the kids. <laughs> he's tired of the bullshit. I'm like, CJ, but don't you... This is me, literally. I'm telling you how I be talking to my own screen. My husband be looking at me like, what the fuck you got going on? But this is just me. I'm like, CJ... Ain't this what you got a lawyer for? Ain't, can't you just tell your lawyer what's going on? Can't you find another different way than putting your other baby mama life in jeopardy? I tell you, child, I tell you. So, he talked about, you know, he hired Nike as security because, you know, it's not him saying that he don't feel safe with Lexi. Let's go say it. Come on, CJ, let's spit it out. You don't feel safe with Lexi because you know Lexi is not going to throw down the way Nike's willing to throw down. You know Lexi, to me, Lexi's not a fighter. She's not. She's more mouth than a fighter. There's a lot of people that got a lot of mouth and less hands, but then again, there's people that have mouth and hands. So, Lexi seems to me the one that has all mouth, but... I think she will throw down if her life is in jeopardy, but she will, let's go say, run back to the car. But, yeah, he said that and everything and all, and I'm standing here and I'm just listening to him rampage and rampage and rampage. And I'm like, this is not it, Lord. This is not it. What is going on with these people? What is going on? I said, what is in the air of Las Vegas? What is in the air? What is going on? How do I feel about this whole situation of the video that he put out yesterday? CJ. CJ, CJ, CJ. CJ, if you have people around you that genuinely fucks with you, that genuinely wants the good for you, will sit you down and tell you this is not it. This is not it. 
I don't understand why everybody wants to run to social media and explore their problems, their family problems, their family situation. Where I don't understand where there's certain things you just leave all social media. Common sense, certain things you leave off social media. This goes for you and this goes for royalty. Certain things y'all leave off, leave off of social media. To me, I'm really starting to feel like both, and I'm going to say it, both of y'all fuckers still have some type, y'all angry towards each other because y'all still love each other. And Lexi, Lexi, start, it's time for you to start waking up. Because if he did this to Nike, if he did this to royalty, and he did it to his own mother, that he even said that he got his own mother fired from her job, and it's gonna tell you, nine out of 10, baby girl, you ain't safe. You ain't safe, you ain't safe, you ain't safe, you ain't safe at all. You would have even had to, I'm gonna say for this one, sleep with one eye open. He's not a bad individual. He's nowhere near that individual. Hell, I stick up like I talk what I talk, and 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 if I feel a certain way, I'm going to speak it. Cause like I said, this is my commentary. I'm not no like I'm always going to keep repeating. Cause these motherfuckers either come in my email or my comments thinking I have to side on somebody bad way. I don't find side on nobody bad way, and that's not me. I'm not on no some whack ass shit. I'm on my own thorough, my own line. So you need to. See one eye open. Like you could love him, genuinely love him. Like I said, be there for him. Help him, girl. Help him and tell him this is not it. This is not it. Don't go put on social media. Let's handle this behind closed doors. Let's handle this with our law. We you know with our family lawyer. You know, if he genuinely wants to be there and continue to fight for his kids, he's gonna fight for his kids no matter what. Cause I can tell he love his kids. He love his kids. But to put your baby mama Nike against royalty, you put both of your baby mama's life in jeopardy. Both of these women have kids by you. Both of these women share a bond with you because they have your seeds. Instead of continue to explore the, dyna the dynamite, let's diffuse it. Diffuse it. Don't you have female family members or something? If anything, why put your baby mama life at risk? Let's go say, right? Let's go say. Let's go say common sense. Because it's like people's not like, CJ, you're not thinking. Not thinking common sense. You go, right? Let's go say pick up the kids. And Charlene goes and start, start talking on her neck and, you know, talking her shit. Nike comes out. You don't know who she got in that car with her, right? You don't know who she got in the car with her. But nowadays, people are using weapons now, or people getting jumped. You feel me? People can get jumped for many years, you know? Because a lot of people don't like fighting one on one. People like to fight unfairly. They get they jump your baby mama, and they kick on the wrong spot on her neck or something. She start avoiding having a seizure. Worst case scenario, something happens to her. How you gonna explain this to your daughter Kamari? Because you're a whole man and you fucking put your balls in your place and do what you gotta do correctly. Don't go putting your baby mama Nike life at risk. And I hope Nike is okay to stand by your baby dad. It's okay to defend him by all means necessary. But you have a daughter that needs you. You have a son back at home that needs you as well too. Think on that. Literally think on that. You feel me? Royalty as well the video i seen that she put out too you was talking in circles you literally was talking in circles you keep yelling calm down we don't need you to be yelling you could talk without yelling you you're yelling at a camera ma'am you're yelling at a camera you need to as well stop your bullshit too you gonna put your baby dead life? Y'all put y'all all putting y'all motherfucking life at jeopardy at this point. Y'all at this point y'all don't give a fuck which way it goes. <laughs> y'all y'all ain't caring for shit which way it goes. And it's sad because like I said, the kids are invested in this shit. The kids are invested as well too, and all these adults is thinking about themselves. If you feel some type of way as well too, don't you got a family lawyer? Deal with it with your family lawyer. 
y'all really sitting there going back and forth with one another. If you not, if you know you not know, as he, as what's his name, CJ knows that you. Excuse me. The way CJ say you a prostitute or you be out there in Las Vegas, you know, in the strip doing what you gotta do for money, and you know that's not true. Let it go one ear out the other ear. One ear out the other ear. Same thing with CJ. CJ, if you know you don't get it in the booty by a man and you know you're not this, let it go in out one ear to another. But at this point, I'm really starting to think this is like for clicks and views, like for money. Like y'all know how to do what y'all got to do because y'all know we, us commentary, us T, well, I'm a commentary. Commentary like me, you know, T pages as well, you know, people that do reactions as well. It's going to talk about it and it's going to bring traffic to your channel and y'all going to get what y'all want. Y'all going to get what y'all want. I just want peace. Like, I want. I would love to see y'all come together as a family and bring peace upon, but y'all some stubborn ass motherfuckers. Y'all so stubborn. Like, hella stubborn. It's, it's like, beyond me at this point, I'm like, what the fuck am I watching? This man really... <laughs> <laughs> this man literally sat here and said, I got 20000 and I hired a security and I pay my baby mama Nike to protect me because I don't feel safe at drop off. Like, what? What? You're not, ba <laughs> You're not many baby fathers deal with the same shit you do, deal with on a day to day basis. If they don't give a fuck, they'll cuss their baby mama out and still take their kids and handle that shit in court. Or some of them just, you know, ignore the shit out of the, the nagger, you know, the one that nags all the time. And and take the kid and just keep going to handle that shit in court. Like, I don't know. I really don't know. Now we got... <laughs> it's just... A whole bunch, a whole bunch. It's like my commentary that I'm giving y'all, I'm saying talking, but I'm laughing because that video last night that he came out with was a big buffoonery because CJ, really, you going to put your baby mama Nike life ever. It's just because you 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 feel she knows how to throw hand. You know she don't back down for nobody. And you, you feel protected about her. Go hire yourself some damn security fee. You know, they, you know there are female security, right? There's female security out there. You should hire yourself some female security. Yeah, you should be hiring yourself some female security instead of putting your baby mama life at risk. But it is what it is, right? They like it. We love it. We adore it. And we're going to just continue to give our commentary on it, right, at this point. But I don't have too much to say because this, this little circus that's going on is going to continue to go on because they just... In circles, they in circles. To me, at this point, they all a bunch of motherfucking clowns. At this point, cause no one's thinking about the kids; they just think about themselves. And Royce, one thing Royce as well too. You said that he wanted to throw a birthday party for your son, Leon. That's nothing. And maybe it was genuine. Like he loved Leon. Like why he had a bond with Leon. That's that's really nothing. I think you overreaching in that point at that part as well too. You really overreaching it. I say. If y'all both feel like the other one, the other one is just harassing or stalking each other, take that shit to court already and stop your shenanigans before something really deadly happen and one of y'all really lose your life because at this matter, it's a matter of time. It's a breaking point and it's going to explode to the extent where somebody could get hurt. The worst case scenario, some one of these kids lose a parent. So... That's the honest thing I could talk about and say. Other than that, this is my thoughts and this is my opinion on all this damn buffoonery, shenanigans, bullshit that's going on. Your opinions, your thoughts are truly welcome in the comments down below. Even if we agree to disagree, but like I say, it's all respect and love for mine. And whoever you rocking with, if you a royalty supporter, a CJ supporter, royalty fan, CJ fan, I give two flying fucks. Y'all can go in the comments down below and give your own thoughts and opinion. Because why? We all think differently and it's always going to be accepted in my end. So I'm your girl, Queen Rose, and I am out to the next video.